be revisiting the, uh, the Mark II turbine. See the clearance of the blades from the pole. Okay, following my previous video, uh, looked like the turbine was running out of balance a bit. Now we've established why. We've got one broken tip there, and another one here. So obviously the 200 mil clearance from the pole isn't sufficient with an 1100mm blade in high wind. I know why this has happened because the uh, turbine furling a bit later it's placed more stress on the blades, the blades have bent back further and clipped the pole which is still very hard to believe but they have. Um, the evidence is right here it's a little bit of silver aluminium foil um, left on the pole so there we are right the plan now rather than to remake the whole lot and have similar problems is just to trim the blades down to the length of the shortest one um, which I would imagine is going to take us down from 1100 mil to about 950 pointless remaking the same blades because the same they'll just hit the pole again unless I shift the motor forward and it's too much hassle to be honest at the moment I want this charging my battery bank all right so there we are let's see how we go with the shorter blades um, and I'll post an update on the end of this video okay thanks so here we are 20 minutes later um, three blades trimmed up I've now cut the blades back to a metre from 11.50 so they're 150mm shorter than they were let's just get an idea of yeah okay they're gonna have to flex an awful lot to hit that pole all we can do is see what's all we can do is see what's gonna happen I think the job's good in that there it is, quick repair. I'm glad I wasn't stuck with remaking that lot. And let's pull it back up in the air. And here we are back up and running again. Um, very, very, very little wind. With the blades trimmed back from 11.50 down to a metre the moment doesn't appear to have affected the high wind sorry the uh, low wind ability of the blades um, let's see what happens on the top end when it gets windy hopefully we'll get over the 400 rpm 20 volt mark now that the blades are balanced up I've also lost the uh, annoying wobble at the top of the pole quick side view showing the distance of the blades from the pole um, now the blades have been repaired hard to believe that they could bend over deflect over 200 mil uh, but they obviously did let's see what happens with these um, I would imagine that they're not going to touch even in the highest wind but uh, we'll see <laughs> 